It's been one week since a Blackford County woman was arrested for driving through a family's home in Montpelier, killing two people and injuring others while allegedly intoxicated. This morning, Brandy Bear appeared before a judge facing multiple felony charges, and our Rachel Krauts was in the courtroom this morning. Family and friends of 74 year old Jerry Jake Michael and five year old Jensen Reynolds gathered outside of the Blackford County Courthouse this morning, calling for justice to be served as the woman alleged to have hit and killed them is in court. Brandy Bear appeared virtually in the courtroom Thursday morning, joining her initial hearing from the Blackford County Jail. Outside, those who knew and loved Jake and Jensen carried signs with their faces on them, wearing shirts that say, I stand with those who can't. Court documents and family say that Bear was driving under the influence last week when she drove her car in through the back of their home, through it and out the front, seriously injuring multiple people and killing Jake and Jensen. Bear is facing seven charges, including causing death while operating a car while intoxicated, reckless homicide, and resisting law enforcement. Her bond was initially set at $5,000. A motion has been filed to increase that. Jensen's father, Jared, says more needs to be done here. It's absolutely pathetic. And telling me my kid ain't worth more than $5,000 is absurd. I mean... I guarantee if she walked by here and I'd done something stupid, I'm getting way more than a $5,000 bond when she she isn't worth more than a dollar. He says they want to see action taken in this case to make sure that Bear won't be able to hurt anyone else ever again. He says they and the community here will not forget.